it felt like everybody was just starting to get to know you. That everybody was looking at us like, who's James Casey? All right, what is he going to do for us? And what is he good at? And, you know, just, just a couple of days of that, and all of a sudden, you know, the Texas signed another uh, another fullback. Today felt a little more, at least to you, might feel more like a more like a bit more like a business than a than a sport today. I mean, not so much. I knew they were going to bring in guys. We have two rookie free agent here as well, so that makes four fullbacks we have on the roster right now. So it didn't feel much different. I'm still out there with the ones, still doing you know everything I've been doing, and I'm going to continue to keep doing that until they tell me to do something else, and until they you know move me around or whatever. So I, you know, I feel. You know, I see myself being a fullback, being out there playing, and you know, I I don't know what the coaches to ha you know have in mind, but you know, my I don't plan on being a slouch at all, fullback, and I plan on going out there and doing my job and helping the team, and let you know let the chips fall where they may. It's just a lot of the stuff's out of my control, so I don't worry about it. Your head coach uh, just said uh, seems he seems to have a, still a lot of confidence in you. He said that James Casey is our starting fullback. Every other guy is just coming in for competition. I mean, does that? Uh, yeah, I didn't. I didn't, haven't heard him say that, yeah. but yeah, that means a lot when he says something like that. And you know, that's that's what I treat. I'm out, I'm a starter now, so you know, when you it's hard to get this. This league's about getting opportunities and getting out in the field and taking advantage of those. So when you get an opportunity to go with the ones, and you got to you got to take advantage of them and don't let anybody come and take you off the field. So that's kind of what I'm trying to do now is just go out there and show I can do it and, and uh, show I need I deserve to be out there and and uh, try to stay on the field. You know, try not to let anybody come out come up there and, and take the spot. So I'm gonna go out there. and full go, you know, like I always do, hard as I can every play, and, and hopefully show the coaches I deserve to be out there. There seems to be as much excitement right now surrounding this franchise as, as there's ever been. You know, the right pieces seem to be coming into place. They're making the right signings. Everyone's like, wow, like, you know, this is going to be for real. Like, how, how, does it, how does it feel amongst the team, like, when you see, when you see guys being brought in that, that you feel are going to make you better and take you to the playoffs? Yeah, we're excited about the free agent guys we picked up and our rookie, you know, the rookie guys that we've been bringing in. So, there's, yeah, there is a lot of excitement, but this year, I mean, there was a lot of excitement last year when we were coming off the nine and seven season. We didn't, you know, you know, perform up to expectations. So this year feels it's exciting, but at the same time, we're just going about our business, and we know what we got to do. We know it's a long season, so we're all about business, all about doing what needs to be done. You know, our, our leaders and our, our veterans, they they're the most important part of our team, and they got to they got to improve because that's the majority of the team. And then the the, the free agents and the rookies that come in. They got to help out as well, and uh, you know we got to. We're focused on just winning football games now, not not really just the excitement and all the hype and stuff. Just you know, just getting to the grind, the hard work of the of the training camp. Cause we know how this is going to pay off when it comes to you know week 15, 16, when hopefully we're playing important football games. As a fullback, you as much as anyone else have to be looking forward to putting on the pads and pads and really getting down and dirty and. Really oh yeah, we we put on the pads today early this morning. Yeah. And we put yeah. just you know, it's full contact, but you're not tackling people. Mm -hmm. So yeah, it feels. It's, it's a lot of fun when you get to finally put the pads on and show the coach what you can do because a lot of guys can be good running out here in just helmets or, and jerseys. You know, we call it underwear. You, some people are, you know, really great underwear players, but when you put the, the pads on, it's a little different. So, and, and you know, we're, we uh, got to do that today. We're going to continue to do that. So that feels good. And then, you know, I, you know, we're really excited about just getting to play somebody else. You start banging on each other for two weeks. You really want to get out there and, and start playing against somebody else.